Hey there traders, have you ever found yourself puzzled wondering why your trades aren't hitting the mark despite all your efforts? Do you ever ponder if there might be some secret tools that pros are using to get ahead? Let's dive in and cover the truth. First off, we're going to explore a powerful tool that's a favorite among seasoned traders. This tool is not just any ordinary tool. It's called MACD 4C Indicator. You can add it from the indicator section of the TradingView website. After adding the MACD 4C indicator, let's make a few adjustments in the indicator settings. This is a unique indicator that gives signals when there is a change in position and color of the histogram. Imagine this, after a few red bars below the mid-level, a green bar appears above the mid-level. That's your cue to buy. And if after a few green bars above the mid-level, a red bar appears below the mid-level, that's your cue to sell. So, let's check a few examples to better understand. We've ran a few examples on the BTC 5-minute chart which made a profit of 88%. And we've ran a few examples on the Nifty 15-minute chart. This goes to show that this tool can work on any chart and time frame. Now, it's important to note that sometimes this tool might give some counter trend signals. We need to identify and filter these out to ensure we're making the best trading decisions. So next up, we have another powerful tool but before that, if you're finding this video helpful so far, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel if you haven't done so yet. We have a lot more insightful content coming your way. The next indicator is a trend detector indicator. It's called CMEMA trend bars indicator. You can add this one also from the indicator section.
Now that we have the CMEMA trend bars indicator on the chart, let's make a few changes in its settings. This tool is not just any indicator, it's a special one that helps us determine whether the market trend is bullish or bearish based on the position of the price relative to the moving average. If the price is below the red moving average line, the trend is bearish, and if it's above the green moving average line, the trend is bullish. Simple yet effective. Finally, let's talk about trading rules. For a buy trade, we need two conditions to be met. First, we need a buy signal, which is the first green histogram bar above the midline after a few red histogram bars. And then we need an uptrend in the market, which we can check using our trend detector indicator. So if both these conditions are met, we can now open a buy position. The stop loss should be below the recent swing low or below the green line. And the target should be set at the risk reward ratio of 1 to 1.5. Now let's discuss trading rules for a sell trade. For a sell trade, we're looking for two specific conditions to be fulfilled. First, we need a sell signal, which is the first red histogram bar below the midline after a few green histogram bars. And then, we need a downtrend in the market, which can be confirmed using our trend detector indicator. So when these two conditions are coincidence, it's time to open a sell position. The stop loss should be set above the recent swing high or above the red line. And the target should be determined by the risk reward ratio of 1 to 1.5. By using the EMA trend bars indicator in conjunction with our first indicator, we can effectively filter out counter trend signals, helping us make more informed trading decisions and avoid unnecessary losses. It's as easy as pie. That's all for today, traders. If you found this video helpful, be sure to check out our recommended video next for more insightful trading strategies.